was once a day that I would pray for you. I'm falling fast, up in here praying that this night's gonna last. You got it all on tap, I'm loving your vibe. Always- the components required for this experiment are Node MC board, LCD display, I2C converter, analog sound sensor module, connecting wires and connecting cable. Now log in to the blink.cloud website. Then go to developer zone. Here click on new template and give the template name. Noise pollution monitoring. And the hardware we are using is ESP8266 and select the connection type as Wi-Fi. And then click on the done button. Now go to data streams and here create a new data stream. Click new data stream, select virtual pin. And here we can give the name as noise level. If you want, we can change this color and select the pin as V0, data type as double, and select the maximum value as 1000. Or we can give 500. And click on the create button. Now go to web dashboard. Here drag the gauge widget. Now go to settings of this gauge and choose the data stream as noise level change this color and click on the save button now save the template now go to devices here click on new device and then select from template here we can see the template which we created select the template and click on the create button now we got the template id template name and authentication token copy this and paste in the program And here we need to install the Blink and Liquid Crystal library and then enter the Wi-Fi username and Wi-Fi password. Now we need to upload the program. For that, go to this drop down, click on this edit button. Here the port is already selected and here we are using the board node MCU. So select node MCU 1.0 and then click on the OK button. Now click this arrow button and upload the program to the node MCU board. Now the program is successfully uploaded to the Node MCU board. Now we need to set up the Blink mobile dashboard. For that, download the Blink IoT application from the Play Store. Now once you open the application, you can see the template which we created in the Blink web dashboard. Now click on the template. Go to settings. And here click the plus button from the bottom. And here we need to add one gauge widget. Now click on that gauge. Choose the data stream as noise level. Go to design and give the title. Now go back and again click the back button. Now the setup is completed and now we can check the output.